Hey everyone, it's your boy Graphic back with another video and today we're going to be talking about what is the fastest way of leveling up your fishing level and why um, why you want to do it this route. I, there's a lot of different people that you know go out there and they say you know buying your fish and actually just using the fish for the fame. I don't know if all of you guys know about it so I will purchase a fish real quick, a random fish uh, and we'll plop it on the food selection and you can have up to 10 stacked at a time just like any other food and let's say I use this it's going to give me 22 fame right there as you see as it goes up and what we're going to see in this video is the cheapest and most effective way of leveling your fishing so if you go through the fishing category you see that there's a tier 1 through tier 8 and obviously it's going to get more and more expensive as you go up through the tiers um, and obviously a tier 8 is going to give you more fame than a tier 2 uh, we're going to have a google document excel sheet in the description below and if you guys take a look at that you guys will see a lot of information there telling you guys let's switch over real quick it'll basically go over what is the best for you um, so obviously everyone wants to go with you know the least cost and the most fame so the best way to do that is by going currently with a tier 2 fish and we're gonna have you know the tier over here 1 through 8 we're gonna have the fame over here starts with 10 goes to 140 based on the tier uh, we have the names there, and then we have the price, and this is based on Carleon Auction House. The Carleon Auction House does seem to be overpriced for fish occasionally, so be aware of that. Um, I do have that in the document. Just make sure you guys see that um, and beware. So you may want to look around at different locations before you start buying your fish. Um, make sure you get the cheapest price. So when I am saying this, this is at the time I'm saying this right now. Um, it is 531 uh, 2019 this is the price sheet for all the fish and you're gonna see right here this is 0 through 100 fishing level um, you need 1.6 mil fame and 1428 learning points to get your fishing level from 0 to 100 to get your fishing level to 0 to 100 without using any learning points it's gonna take you 8 million and 24,000 fame so you're going to see the cost is absolutely crazy over here without using any learning points. If you just plan on buying fish to level your uh, fishing level, this is going to be the route that um, you're not going to want to take. It's going to cost a lot more if you just don't use your learning points. Make sure you use learning. Ooh, make sure you use your learning points to um, level your fishing level, as it's going to you know save you so much money. It's going to save you what 40 mil on the cheapest option about 40 mil so make sure you guys do take the time to just use your learning points uh, as you get them if you're not using them on other things that are more important um, but basically the cheapest options are gonna be ranked up here uh, I went through and made this took, did take a little bit of time guys so I hope you guys do appreciate really do appreciate this I, I was always wondering myself you know what's the best option if I was going to just buy fish and level up um, but best ranking uh, cost to fame is gonna definitely be that tier 2 fish um, you'll be able to see here that it's about 9,600,000K, um, which is not bad at all to get your level all the way to 100 and being able to go out there and start, you, you know, catching that tier 8 fish that early on uh, just by, you know, spending a little bit less than 10 mil. I just think that's crazy. And there's really all these options aren't bad as long as you're not going the tier 8 route, the, the lazy route. It takes less clicking, obviously, but it's not worth doing, trust me. So this is a little spreadsheet for you guys as we hop right back into the actual game itself. Um, and like I said, the, look at the tier 8 prices. It's just not worth doing. Um, but let's go to the Destiny board real quick. And my fishing level is real low. Um, but I have done a little bit of fishing. And, you know, I do actually find the activity fun. But what would be a lot more fun to me is being able to run and do some tier 8 fishing than tier 4 rather than you know obviously the low tier fishing is going to be a lot uh, more boring and you know less I don't know it's gonna be less exciting tier 8 is just gonna be a lot whole different kind of story for you guys so this is just one way to level your fishing without actually fishing um, so if you just want to get right right into it and you have the silver for it go ahead and go for it um, but what you'll see is I have on the Google sheet I have the fact that you need to use a thousand four hundred twenty eight learning points uh, for you, you guys that don't know this, that's when you reach this little, little uh, what do you call that, 20% mark. When you reach the 20% mark, you need to be using your learning points right away. And that's how you will actually uh, use the least amount of fame 
to level up your uh, fishing. So I hope this guide was a little bit, you know, I mean, it should be pretty obvious um, how to level it up in general. Obviously, you go out there and you go fishing is the best way to do it. And then you eat your fish for additional fame. But this is going to be the second option. Uh, if you just want to go the lazy route, this Excel sheet should have everything you need. And I just updated it as of 6.14 p.m. on 5.31.2019, like I said earlier. So if you guys do look at this sheet, it does help you decide what's the cheapest price as of now. Uh, I'm sure it will change uh, and it will fluctuate a little bit. But T8 will obviously never be the right choice. Um, but I hope you guys do appreciate the time I put into this Excel sheet um, and figuring out the prices and everything. And uh, that'll be today's video and I'll see you guys next time.